Ahoy hoy YouTube modeling community. It's the lazy, 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 lazy eyed modeler here with you. It's been a long time. I apologize. Um, there's a reason for all the lazies and the lazy eyed modeler. It's just uh, summer hit, the heat hit, and uh, that was it. I no ambition whatsoever. Uh, that was one long hot summer. Um, so I apologize for my absence. Um, I have nothing in the way of, of builds to show. And, um, I mean, I've, I've, um, toyed with some stuff here. Um, toying with some Dave Deals wheels from Ravel. Um, some of the Volkswagen kits there, but, uh, nothing to show for the course of the summer. So, um... Well, that's it for now, <laughs> as far as updates, as progress, or anything. Uh, so I'm just going to skip ahead to uh, events. Uh, September 22nd, uh, today is the 24th, uh, Monday, September 24th. Saturday, September 22nd, there were two contests in here in Ontario, Canada. One was an IPMS-style um, contest in London, Ontario. And uh, the other was a model car contest in Ottawa, Ontario, um, <clears throat> except for one thing. Unfortunately, on September 23rd, uh, sorry, September 21st, Friday, September 21st, uh, we experienced some wild weather here in Ontario. In Ottawa, Ontario slash Gatineau, Quebec, uh, a couple of tornadoes touched down there. Um, there was um, there's some heavy damage, uh, some heavy damage to the electrical grid, including like whole, at least one whole power station that was pretty much wiped out. Um, so there was at least 140,000 people without power at the height of the, you know, after it happened. Um, to the best of my knowledge, there were no injuries or if there or deaths, or if there were injuries, it was just minor injuries. Um, the Ottawa Club met at the location where the uh, contest was supposed to happen on September 22nd at, uh, at a church. They were there at 7 as they normally would be for set up for a contest. And they had people rolling in for the contest, but they had no power. And finally at 8.30 in the morning they had to declare that the contest was cancelled. So um, they had to reschedule it. And it is rescheduled for this coming Saturday, Saturday, September 29th. Now the problem with that is, now we have two model car contests here in Ontario, Canada, um, on the same day. Because now we have the Ottawa Scale Auto Contest in Ottawa on September 29th. And here, because uh, I thought of something that I wanted to mention uh, when I made first made this video and I forgot and just as I'm uh, editing the video I realized I did not mention this but the model car minion uh, Steve lives in the greater uh, in the Ottawa area uh, in the area that was um, affected by these storms um, I, he's not in the area that where the tornado uh, touched down uh, at least to the best of my knowledge but he's probably been without power uh, for at least a couple days now. I don't know for sure. I haven't been in touch uh, But I just wanted to say Steve if you're uh, if you see this we're thinking of you I hope you and Ann are doing well and uh, Hope things get back to normal for you soon. Okay back to the rest of the show. Thanks. We also have the group 25 annual model car contest on September 29th now one of the members from Ottawa told me they knew you know that um, Toronto, the contest is on Toronto, but they had a limited choice as far as backup dates at their location, so they kind of had to take what they could. So depending where you live here in Ontario, you can either go to Toronto or you can head to Ottawa for a model car contest. Uh, the theme for the Group 25 contest is uh, T's and A's, and um, that's hap <clears throat> excuse me, happening at uh, Franklin Horner Community Center. 432 Horner Avenue, Etobicoke, Ontario. So you can look that up. 
if you're uh, in Ontario, Canada, uh, go check out one of the two contests. Help support the people that put the contests on because they put a lot of work into it. And, um, you know, it's nice to have people show up when you put all that work into it. And I'm just going to adjust us a little bit here. Sorry for the jiggling. There we go. Um, and, of course, the other contest happening on September 29th, which is not in Canada, it's not happening in Canada. It's happening in at, in New Jersey, in Wayne, New Jersey, is the Diversified Scalers uh, model car meet at uh, One Pal Drive, Wayne, New Jersey, from nine till three nine a.m. till three p.m. That's the location where NNL East is held. Uh, so uh, if you guys in the uh, Northeast want to go check that out, I'm sure it's a great show. I wish I kind of wish I could check out the show with the the guys down there but I'll be going to Toronto uh, the next okay uh, sorry for the little jump there but I still haven't learned that I can't hold uh, flyers up in front of my face without screwing up the camera so we're gonna this is a uh, take two for <laughs> the rest of the flyers that I have going uh, the next show coming up is the NNL Nationals in Sylvania um, Toledo, Ohio, Toledo, Ohio, slash Sylvania, Ohio. Uh, their theme is Junk in the Trunk. Uh, I can't find another theme listed on here. Usually there's two, I think. And often there's a cult theme, and I haven't seen anything about that. And considering how close we are to um, the actual event, I don't know if they're having a cult theme. But if, you, uh, if you're into um, building uh, mid-engine vehicles, rear-engine vehicles... Uh, you know, rear engine dragsters, like you can see right there. Um, and or if you want to go to the granddaddy of all the NNLs, go check them out. Uh, you have to pay to go into the toy show, or you can just kind of come in the door and pay to go to the NNL. But if you want to do both, you have to pay for both. Uh, it's a different situation with them, but it's always a good uh, show and turnout. Uh, so go check them out. The next uh, flyer is uh, back here in Canada. It's uh, L'Exposition Amicale de Modèle Réduite. It's in uh, Charlesburg, Quebec. Uh, so if you're in eastern Ontario or in Quebec or maybe even in some of the maritime provinces, you might want to go check that out. Um, and that's it for that one. Uh, back here in Ontario on Sunday, November... November 4th, uh, 2018, obviously, um, is Wellcom, uh, the Wellington County Modelers uh, Exhibition. Uh, this is a IPMS style event, so it's, you know, it's all categories. It's not just cars, it's tanks, planes, sci-fi, you name it, figures. It's happening at uh, Aberfoyle, Ontario, at the Pooslink. Community Center, 23 Brock Road South. Uh, so you might want to go check that out. And last but not least of the flyers I have and the events that I'm aware of for uh, 2018, and this is one I intend to go to, and it's the Detroit Area Auto Modelers. It's um, the Motor City NNL. Class of 68 is the main theme, so any cars from 1968. And the sub-theme is bedtime, so pickups, El Caminos, Rancheros, that type of thing. Uh, it's happening at the, and I never know exactly how to say this correctly, so I apologize to those of you who live around there, but the Maycomb Community College Sports and Expo Center. Uh, it's located at the southwest corner of 12 Mile Road in Hayes Road in Warren, Michigan. Uh, they always have a huge vendors area. Um, I've left quite a bit of money at this show. <clears throat> anyway, and they get, uh, it's a show that's been growing quite a bit. They get a, a um, I think the first time I went there, you know, if they had a couple hundred models, that was it. I think the last time it was, I stand to be corrected. But I think it was 450, maybe more. I'm not sure, but it's a show. It's one show that's actually uh, growing. Uh, so if you're in the Detroit area, you know, uh, Western Ontario, 
anywhere, you know, in the northern central states, I'd say it'd be worth your time to go check it out. So that is the um, Motor City NNL. Now that's all the events I had to cover for now. Um, I'm kind of doing this off the cuff. I hope to talk about more stuff, but I'm, I'm dumping stuff all over my desk here as I talk. Um, and I can't think of the other things I wanted to talk about. I, like I said earlier, I haven't made any progress at anything, any of the group builds I said I was involved in or anything like that. Um, and I can't think of anything else I want to add at this point. So with the two videos glued together, this is going to be long enough. I hope to make more videos soon and, you know, create more content here. Um, again, sorry I've been gone so long. I've been trying to... I've been so lazy during the summer that I haven't even really kept up with videos. I mean, I popped in on a few and... I mean, I try to... The ones I do catch, at least leave a thumbs up or a like. Uh, some of them I've left some comments, but I've, I'm really behind and I apologize for that too because I kind of feel like I let you guys down in a way that when you're producing content. But anyway, now that falls here, I'm hoping to uh, get myself spun back up and, and doing uh, more content and watching uh, more of the hobby related videos and letting you know that I'm watching and um, you know, hopefully getting some models built. Uh, there's a couple of Dave's deals. Whoops heads here from deals wheels I'm working on the uh, if you know the deals wheels there's the van there's the glitter bug there's Baja humbug so like so like so and like so so we'll see how that works out anyway I'm gonna leave it here enough chaos for one uh, uh, one video and we'll talk to you soon bye now